The, the dawn of the moving image begins early in the 19th century with the discovery that a surface treated with a photosensitive emulsion will reveal an image when exposed to light. These first photos, or tintypes, were crude forms of photography improved upon by the creation of more flexible photosensitive material, or film, which resulted in better still photographic images. Yeah. Photographic images whose subjects were photographed in slightly different positions could be flipped in rapid succession to create the illusion of subjects in motion. Edward Murrow Bridge, while trying to prove that a racehorse's hooves were at one time all in midair, set up multiple cameras which were tripped by a wire as the horse ran down the track. Yeah, the result is a crude depiction of a horse in motion. George Eastman of Eastman Kodak fame created a celluloid film stock that could be wound on a reel, resulting in the first actual example of moving images on film. Experiments in the 1890s by W.K.L. Dixon and William Heiss under the auspices of the Thomas Edison Company resulted in the invention of the kinetograph, a vertical feed camera which exposed film and had a row of sprockets on each side of the celluloid strip, much like our conventional 35 millimeter film today. These first films were often a mere tens of feet long and ran less than half a minute, but audience interest was peaked nonetheless. Let's take a look at two early Edison films. Well, these films of a strong man and a dancer lack a story. They were revolutionary nonetheless. Yeah, Edison was not only a master inventor, but, but a very savvy businessman as well, preferring to charge individual viewers for a chance to watch the flickering images. To project his films, Edison invented the single viewer kinetoscope, shown here. Yeah, this means of projection was fundamentally a box with a peephole that viewers could look into for the price of a nickel. Short films would play on a continuous loop, with the film never stopping or starting on the same frame. To maximize profit for his burgeoning business, Edison applied for and was awarded American patents on inventions created within his company. And of course, Jeffrey, he constructed the first ever motion picture studio called the Black Mariah, shown here. 